Hey, what's going on? Um, so I got this flip video camera. Thing's fucking great. Um, and so I started using it to make videos with my tripod. This tripod, you know, tripod. How hard is that to make? That I've had for, uh, I don't know, a long time. Uh, I bought it years ago. It's made by Saker. S-A-K-A-R. It's called the, uh, the model number is the TR-11. The Saker, TR-11. Uh, hopefully they don't make this piece of shit anymore. So anyway, I bought this years ago. I don't know where I got it. Um, it looks pretty beat up, but uh, it, it's not it's not for overuse. I hardly ever use this thing. Um, anyway, it's just been sitting around in my garage and, uh, you know, wherever, attics. I've moved it from place to place, wherever I've lived. So I just started using it with my uh, my flip video camera because I started making videos, instructional videos, and uh, so I just just now I was gonna go make a quick video to fire off to my friend. And um, let me uh, get to it. so this is how this, this is how a tripod works, or one of the aspects of the tripod. This thing goes on top, connects to the top of it, and then. You attach your camera here, and then in order to, then you can tilt this way and that. And this is the lever that this goes inside, and this is the lever that you find your whatever angle you want, and then you tighten this up, right? So I was just trying to tighten this up to get the camera situated where I wanted to, and the, the fucking inside of it is stripped. This cheap shit stripped crap. Um... I mean, literally, this thing's probably been tightened, uh, I don't know, 20 times, maybe? Tightened and loosened? <laughs> um, I mean, look at that. The threads are all shot. I mean, what kind of cheap shit metal do they use? And I also noticed when I started using this recently is that it was, like, gooey. It was some, like, goo. Real, real sticky shit, like, around this part of it. And it's from the inside. So whatever sort of lubrication they use at the factory, whenever they made this piece of shit, freaking, I don't know, 10 years ago, uh, just started to like ooze out. So if this is uh, if this is what we're gonna get from China for the next freaking hundred years of our existence, because they have fucking slave labor, this thing was probably made for like, I don't know, a nickel in China, maybe a dollar, U.S. dollar in China probably charged me 30, 40 bucks 10 years ago for it. I don't know, maybe it was only 25 bucks. Whatever. I mean, that's what you get. You get shit. You use it 10 times and the, and the thing just falls to shit. So, be on the lookout. The brand is Saker. S-A-K-A-R. And it's, I'm sure they don't make this anymore. The TR-11. But don't even buy any of these products because they're crap. Um, clearly. So, you get what you pay for. Just, uh... Wanted, wanted to uh, pass that along to the rest of the world via YouTube. Send it around. I'll be sure to put all these, tag it properly so everybody can find it. Do uh, read up or, or, or watch up, watch and listen up on uh, Saker tripod products. All right, take it easy.